Good day everyone, just playing around with the high pass filter and thought I'd just show you some of the results I was getting on my oscilloscope. Might help you to sort of visualize how they actually work. Um, so I'll just show you how I've got the circuit set up first. So this is the circuit, it's very straightforward, just a 10k resistor to ground and a 100 nanofarad capacitor on the input. And when you do the calculation for that, it says that the corner frequency should be at 160 hertz. Basically the corner frequency is where the the signal has been reduced by about 28 to 30 percent um, and you measure that in between the resistor and the capacitor which is this probe here um, which will be the red signal on the screen whereas the yellow signal is the input signal and that's just connected to the input. So I've got a 159 hertz signal on the input that's the yellow signal that you're seeing there and the red signal is the filtered signal and as you can see it's smaller than the uh, original signal and if you look at the voltages peak to peak, um, you can see the input signal is about 800 and the, and the filtered signal is about 560 and I, I've put that in the calculator before and it's around 30%. So that's the corner frequency and if you keep going below that signal, um, it'll get smaller and smaller. So I'll just play with this slider here and we'll just lower it a bit. I have to change the time because it's getting off the screen. As you can see, it gets smaller and smaller. Now it's down to 100. And 28 millivolts on um, uh, the frequency is 25 hertz and likewise if you go the other way <clears throat> you can see that red signal you might be able to see it there that red signal gets larger as I increase the hertz if you want to monitor the hertz what I'm adjusting you can see that the hertz down the bottom there it's currently on 68 and as you increase it that signal gets larger and larger and that's effectively how a a filter works. Also might notice how the phase changes as well as I lower the hertz the um, signals um, become out of phase you can see that red signal starts to drift. So this is a view in XY mode of the filter and you can see that um, they're pretty close there I'm on 12k 12 kilohertz at the moment as you go down they slowly sort of start to separate you start to get a eclipse I guess you'd call it um, as the phase starts to separate further and further so that's it for this video, just a quick one. Just thought I'd just show you a few oscilloscope views to help you sort of visualize um, how the filter works. The uh, low pass filter works exactly the same, except when you go past the corner frequency the, in the other direction, um, it starts to attenuate. Um, sorry, the other way around. It doesn't attenuate under, under it, but it will attenuate over. The higher frequencies will be cut off. Low pass filter, the low frequencies pass, like I said before. That's how I remember it. So I hope you got something out of the video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.